Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel, <laughs> taking over. <laughs> you guys, this is a very exciting video for us to make. We're a little shifty right now, we're a little nervous, but today we're here to announce and share our part two of our collection with Dose of Colors. It's a little over a year since our original Desi X Katie collection yep. came out with Dose of Colors last year. It's like our anniversary. It's like an anniversary. Except the one that you forgot, so we're celebrating late. Yes. So we brought back some of the favorites from the first collection, and we have all new stuff also. So new products with Dose. We were so excited that Anna wanted to work with us again. Like, we thought she was, you know, done with us. Yeah. She's like, I can't <laughs> with these two anymore. They're crazy. Get out of here. But you guys know we love Anna. We love Dose of Colors so much. So this was just like, duh, when she asked us if we wanted to do a part two. I said, Anna. Anna. Do I want to do a part two? And you held your sponge like that. I held my sponge. <laughs> so today in this video, we're going to be going through the entire collection, really kind of breaking down the products, formulas, mm -hmm. sharing the new stuff, more details. This is like a details kind of video. And then, yes. I'm just showing my She's showing my her details. shadow. I'm showing a detail as well. Thank you so much. My lips. I feel... So good about my makeup today. Like you're, she was feeling herself. I've been okay. walking around with my eyes closed. So. She walks around like this. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's for dinner? And then on Desi's channel, we filmed a get ready with me mm -hmm. or get ready with us. Yes, us. Get ready with us video using the collection. So you guys have to check that out. Yeah. So go check it out on her channel. Let's just let's just dive right in. You know, let's do this. I'm gonna scoot a little closer to you. I feel a little far away. You just never want to be next to me. Well, it's hard. So this collection, Desi X Katie Round Two, is coming out next week, a week from today, mm -hmm. on DoseOfColors.com. And then the following week, it's also gonna be available at Ulta. Yes. Uh, we're Ooh. so excited. I can't wait to go see the display at Ulta. Like it's gonna be so yeah. cool. It's, it's really so nice. Cool too because people get to go into the store you get to swatch and mm -hmm. play with everything i mean to be in the store is going to be really exciting for us it's pretty cool it's pretty major okay our collection is a total of nine items that are launching and two of them are throwbacks from throwbacks the first round that we did desi yes. x katie round one and the ones that you guys almost killed us for yes let's just start with those so over the top is coming back you guys uh i am so excited about this because i kind of was feeling guilty for using it i was as well and then also it is my all-time favorite gloss so i feel like it just had to come back it had to come back it had to come back mm -hmm. so over the top is coming back the lip gloss that is just Amazing. It has a clear base with gold reflex in it. It mm -hmm. looks amazing by itself. Super glossy. Looks so good on top of like nude lips. It's just, it's looks everything. good on top of nothing. Just nothing by itself. Bare lips mm -hmm. too. So this was like definitely a favorite of ours. Mm -hmm. And also a lot of you guys mentioned that you were cool with it. Yeah. <laughs> so we brought over the top back. That's one of the first products that we brought back. And we also brought back Fuego. Mm -hmm. This is my favorite highlight of all time. I love Fuego. We're super excited um, that this is coming back. Beyonce was wearing Fuego the other day. She was. Just letting you guys know, she Beyonce was. was wearing Fuego the other day. Insert and image here. I am dying. So <laughs> I just had to. I just had to say that out loud because I haven't said it yet. We're so excited this is coming back. So those are the two products from the first collection that we did. Round that one are coming back. That's round one. So now we're gonna go ahead and jump into round two, the new stuff. All right, the first thing we're gonna talk to you guys about is our new friendcation palette are you ready boom yay yes bitch <laughs> Ooh, I can see you've dug into that one down I, there. I sure have girl. <laughs> this is our new friendcation 10 eyeshadow pan Palette. Oh, that one looks nicer. Mm -hmm. That's a newer one, huh? This one hasn't been like handled by me. As well. <laughs> <Is that laughs> like we wanted to make sure that it was a palette that when you opened it up, it was unique. It had pops of color. It had your neutrals. You could do something super over the top or super minimalistic. Since we called it Frankation especially, we want this to be the only palette you take on your Frankation. The formulas in these shadows, they are like super, super rich, super creamy. We're like, if you see somebody wearing it out, you want to be like, oh my God, what eyeshadow is that? Yes. That's like the reaction that we wanted to have when you wear it. So like right Right now, our looks are super different. It's like, oh damn, what eyeshadow you want? Well, eyeshadow. Wait till you see it in the sun. I mean, it yeah. just looks so sparkly, so gorgeous, so sparkly, amazing. Yeah. And unlike our first palette, you don't need any special instructions to apply these eyeshadows. It's just straight from the pan. Boom. Throw it on. Boom. All right. So here are all the eyeshadows in our palette, starting from this side over here. This is a moment because it truly is a moment. It's a moment. It's a moment. Then we have Dirty Money. Oof, 
Dirty money is everything. Necessary, we named it necessary because it's kind of a shade you just need in an eyeshadow palette. Cheens. Then we have basic, we named this after John. <laughs> <laughs> this shadow is named Try Me. Just a Kiss, Girl Bye, Churro, and Game Over. Cause this is just... Game over, you're done. Game over. See you later. Yep. So the first shade um, that we have on our palette is called Basic, and Basic is a muted light pink. For this one, we are really thinking like a transition color, something that you can just really like start the process with. Start the process. You can do that or use it as like a color on the lid if you want to do something more matte. Mm -hmm. If you want to go for like an overall more matte look. But for deeper skin, you could even use it as a brow bone highlight, mm -hmm. inner corner highlight. I mean, I use it for all three of those things, so. Mm. The next shade that we have is Cheens. Mm. We've had so many cappuccinos together. We named, oh yeah, ca Cheens is short for cappuccino mm -hmm. for us, and mm -hmm. we had many Cheens in Switzerland on our trip as a squad, and so there's really nothing that makes us happier than a, yeah. good, a good cup of Cheens. All four, we just think all four of us sitting together having a Cheens, yeah. you know? Who's in the mood for a Cheens? Nobody ever says no. No. Never we happens. Always, I've never heard of such a thing. This shade is a deep chocolate brown, mm -hmm. which is also pretty, like, yeah. you need a deep chocolate you brown. You need a deep, rich rich chocolate mm -hmm. brown. The next shade, Necessary. This is something we felt like we just needed to have in this palette. It's a necessary color. It's a nice light brown that you can just put into the crease before your deeper shades mm -hmm. or for a more neutral everyday look, just into the crease. Mm -hmm. And this is a neutral mid-tone brown. Mm -hmm. The next shade we have is Dirty Money. When we created the shade, it was like, mm, like we just kind of like felt oh. it in our soul. It's an olive green mm -hmm. with an antique gold shift. Yeah. And it's like sometimes it almost seems a little bit more bronzy. Sometimes it seems a little bit more green. Yeah, it just depends on. It depends on the lighting. Also what you put in the crease. Yep. Awesome. I've never seen a color like it personally. And the way it makes, well, I mean, we both have brown eyes. So that's yeah. how we know it. It really, especially Katie has a little bit of a lighter brown and she has like little flecks. So when she puts that on, it makes her eyes look even lighter brown. Like it just brings out all the light tones in your eyeball. It's rich. So the next shade, we're just, oh my God, living and dying for. This is an Everything. electric blue with a, with purple. a purple shift. Yeah. I want to say like electric purple shift. Like it's like a shocking purple. Not it's almost like, like the purple neon sign. Yeah, it's like, like the, a neon. Like, you know what I mean? Like a neon sign. If you were to take that and turn it into reflex, like mm -hmm. crush it into a reflex and then throw it into this blue. Yep. That's what it looks like on your eyes. It's incredible. And it's like when it, I see it on camera, it looks like way more blue. Mm -hmm. But then when I look at it right here, it's like you're seeing the reflex. It's electric when I look at it. So it's just such a cool color. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, that's what I have on right now. Try Me is a cranberry red. This is also another like t filled with reflex. All the, the shadows that are shimmery in here are just like loaded with reflex. For Katie, <laughs> Try Me is a bold color. And I think it's bold too, because it is a more coppery red tone. Yeah. You can pair it to make it way more bold if you want to use bolder colors with it, mm -hmm. but you used it with this down here and it mm -hmm. just looks, it looks like bomb. I love it. Yeah, it looks so good. Mm. It's a cranberry red with like kind of like a, it's like a pinky orange shift oh, to it. It's so pretty. And yeah. I feel like out of the palette, this is gonna be such a good color for fall. Also dirty money mm -hmm. for fall, but like mm -hmm. this color just, it, looks it so speaks good. speaks to me. And this next one, Just a Kiss. This is literally just straight pure reflex. It has like a sheer base pure to reflex. it. So it's not gonna add like a color to the eye. It's really gonna like use whatever you have on underneath it. It's and a then similar concept yeah. as our lip glosses over the top lip gloss. It has a similar concept where it's like, we want those reflex and we want it to be like bam reflect, but not a super opaque undertone. Mm -hmm. But it's that color beautiful. is so, I love wearing that with just like, just a little bit of either like basic or girl by in the crease and then just throwing just a kiss in the center. It's like, also, inner corner highlight, pop in. I actually have an yeah. inner corner too. Just like you just take it and pop, pop, and you're done. So good. This next shade is Girl Bye, and I love this color unexpectedly. This is one of those ones that was like, you know, a little out of my zone, like my I regular love. zone, but I love it. I have it in my crease today. You also have it in your I crease. I do. This is also what I used in my crease mm -hmm. as well. And this shadow is just perfect. Like it's not too red. And it blends like not too dream. pink. Yeah, it's just like, it's amazing. I love it. And it works well with so many different colors. Like it looks amazing with this blue. Can you say this one? You say it better than I do. Churro. <laughs> and this is a rich, warm brown. Um, so because we have- I'm Katie's churro. Yeah, she's my little churro. Cause I'm rich, warm, and brown. <laughs> <laughs> 
Also, this is like one that you could wear by itself with just a kiss. You can use I love it with dirty money. That's my favorite mug. Yeah, you can use it with so many different colors. It's just one of those like, like a staple that you want in your mm -hmm. palette. It's perfect um, for an everyday eyeshadow look. Mm -hmm. This is like the perfect in between, not too light, not too dark. I oftentimes just put this in my crease and I do nothing else with like, you know, lash or whatever. Yeah, it's just a really good fucking color. <laughs> <laughs> and this last color is just game over. This game one, over. This one we called game over. This is a midnight black with silver reflex. Mm -hmm. It's a foiled eyeshadow with so many reflex. Your eye is gonna look like wet asphalt. Yes. Like the night sky through a microscope. They just Wait, poured the asphalt. Microscope. Uh, telescope? Yes. Telescope. Telescope. Nice. Good one. It's, you know, my Spanish English. Rich. It just looks like when wet asphalt is sparkly. Do you know what I'm talking about? That look? I don't know if I've ever seen the sparkly wet asphalt, but I yeah, see what you mean. Haven't you, John? I know exactly what you're talking about. <laughs> exactly. John knows exactly what I'm talking about. It is the ultimate smoky eye like if you're trying to do it this is gonna be the game over like yeah oh my god it looks so sick and low light like it's so sparkly you guys will see it in the swatches but mm -hmm. it's just amazing next thing we want to share is our new highlight shade and this is called chasing the sun i love the name like the reason of the name chasing the sun comes from <laughs> if you guys watched our snaps or ig stories a lot of time katie and i are seriously chasing the sun to get the perfect makeup photo. You know those photos that people take in the sunlight and you'll be racing against time just to get the makeup done before the sun goes down mm -hmm. and the best time to get like a skin or highlight like or highlight any type of glow is when the sun is just in the right spot. Yep. And so this highlight is definitely um, inspired by that sun-kissed, drenched in the sun look. So I'm wearing it right now and, and as you can see, <laughs> I look rather moist. Mm -hmm. Very moist. Like, very damp. This is the highlight. It looks so beautiful. It's not super chunky. It's so smooth. Yeah. It looks like wet. This is actually a golden bronze highlight, whereas this one, light champagne. Light gold. champagne. It's so beautiful. It complements Fuego really well. Okay, now it's time to get into the lip products. And we went in on lips. We sure did. So five new, new, new. New, new. So this is actually a liquid velvet is what we're calling it. We wanted a liquid formula that was comfortable. velvety, comfortable, one that throughout the day you could reapply and reapply and it's fine, or you could just kind of go like this mm -hmm. and it doesn't crack or yeah. dry or anything like that. Well, I don't feel it on my lips. I don't feel like I'm wearing anything. It just feels like my lips, you know? <laughs> we created two colors in this formula and she had a vision for a moth story. The person who didn't love moms, remember? I hated she them so She now loves much. moms. I hated them so much. And I really wanted a color just like the one I'm wearing right now, and this is called My Mane. My Mane, because I mane. wanted a color that I could wear without makeup, like more of a natural makeup look, and then, of course, here, with a makeup look. And I have it on with a lip liner right now. I wore it with a Spice lip liner by MAC. But on my days where I do just concealer and glow, I just apply this, and it's the perfect color that gives your face life. It kind of reminds me of like Angelina Jolie's lips. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? Like her natural lip color, just that yeah. like, ooh. It's just everything. I love this color and it's just, oh. It's my main. It's so pretty. It's my main. I'm really happy with and it. And you can see it has a slightly like satin finish to it. It mm -hmm. doesn't, it's not a liquid matte lipstick. And like I can just go like this. Mm-hmm. No butthole mouth. Mm, no butthole mouth of this lipstick. So one of my favorite things about this formula is I have very wrinkly lips. Liquid matte lipstick, sometimes it can enhance that. I feel like especially with a lighter shade, mm -hmm. you can see it a lot more. So that was something that was really important when we created this formula, that it looks really good on the lips. Like, like it looks hydrating. It looks hydrating, it looks smooth, very creamy. And that's one thing that I love about this lipstick is that it doesn't give me crinkle lips. And I think it just looks so good. And the shade that I have here is called a mauve story. I'm telling a mauve story these days and I'm not afraid of it. This one, I feel like because it has the satin finish, that's why I love it so much. Mm -hmm. It's like a, a muted, soft, milky. like a natural milky mauve. Yeah, it's a like, cool toned shade. It's definitely more cool toned. Listen, do not come for us because we did nude lipsticks. They're not, they're neutrals. You have to love a good neutral lip, yeah. okay? But don't come for me. Do not. Do not, do not, listen. <laughs> do not, because these colors are lit. They're lit. And listen, 
Listen, listen to me again. <laughs> Keep listening. Keep listening. Each one of these lip products could be worn every day of my life, and I have a different mood for each of them, you know? And you, would be, you wouldn't feel like you're dying. No, I would yeah. feel fabulous. Yeah. Uh, incredible. I am so excited about this formula. You guys like, are gonna love the formula. The formula is amazing. It's so comfortable to wear. If you feel like liquid matte lipsticks are too dry, Okay, uh, the next product that we have is two traditional lipsticks. This is the same formula as our More Creamer Please No yes. Shade, that, those lipsticks. It's the same formula as that, so it's like a creamy matte. Yep. And the first shade that we have is called Hey Girl. This is a very pink color, I would say, but not like a vibrant pink. Definitely not a vibrant pink. No. It's more of like, this is also like a muted pink. Yes. I love this color. It's, it's not too light. A lot of like the peachy pinks are definitely a lot lighter, like No Shade is much a lighter, lot lighter than this one. It's such a good daily moment. This like, is the shade that I basically wore all throughout Ibiza and everybody kept asking me what lip color oh, yeah. was. And almost like every picture, if you look back, I just did like, you know, a little bit of a hodgepodge lip liner moment, like a really, really lip liner moment. And then I just... And she wouldn't share it with me, by the way. We only had one sample We only had one sample. And she would not let me use it. Honestly, I think you stole it because Honestly. after... <laughs> After Ibiza, it was you gone. You guys! It was gone. We created it together and she was just like... We only had one sample. <laughs> it's so good. This is it. And I love, like, one thing I love about neutral lipsticks, especially now that I've gotten really comfortable with lip liner, is pairing it with different lip liner tones, you can get a totally different look yeah. with the lipstick. You could use spice lip liner or you could use something more taupe or you could use something more pink. Our next shade, this is such a cool color. We were like, what is like a really sick color lipstick that we could come up with? This one is the boldest out of all the lip colors that we did. And this shade is called Aftermath. And this one is such a beautiful, rich cognac. Like I want to eat it when I see yeah. it. I want to drink it actually. Well, we all know your problem with chocolate. This is still in the neutral family and it's, it's gonna read differently on different skin tones So if you have deeper skin, it's gonna look like a really nice neutral shade on you and you have more fair skin It's gonna be a little bit more bold. Mm -hmm. It's this really rich beautiful cognac color So I'm really excited about our lipstick shades. They're mm -hmm. bomb. They're bomb. Did we talk about this already? No, we haven't talked about it yet. Oh! Guys, I'm gonna put it on just for the video. When we we knew we wanted to create another gloss, right? So obviously we have over the top going back, and we were over like, the top OG. What like a sister of over the top could we come up with? Like what could we do that's super sick? That's also like that you can wear it by itself. The hoier sister. Yes, she's a little more. She's the wild sister. Sneaks out at night. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. She's a risk taker. Yeah. We have over the tops. Holy Wild older sister. sister. <laughs> and <laughs> this gloss is called The Most. So this is a clear base with cherry red and platinum reflex mixed together. And it is like, boom. I'm wearing boom. this one right now. She's wearing it right now. You can tell more when I'm in, you know, direct light. You can see like the, the cherry color that's in it. I it's like, not overpowering cherry either. It's not like. No, it's almost like. Pinky cherry. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put it on, you even it though on. I liked my color matte, but I'm gonna put it on. Yeah. So just like over the top, remember when we talked about over the top last time? It doesn't look clear in the tube. Oh. But she when is you put it on, yeah. Freaking. When you put it on, it is clear. Same with this one. This one looks more white in the tube, but it still goes on sheer. So good. I don't really love a colored gloss because if it gets stuck in your hair and then there's, God forbid, a Shit gust can, of wind. It can go down. Bus wind. Bus, Bus wind. wind. Oh, the then worst. the hair and the gloss just like leaves. Yeah. I don't, I just, no. So it's literally just the perfect sister oh, to over oh, the top. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> She's really feeling it right now, mm -hmm. you guys. I love it. I love that it's pink, but it's like not in your face pink, you know? Just like the gold. She's going in. I got jealous. Look how much bigger my lips look now. Juiced. Do the, do this plastic surgery face. <laughs> All right, so that is our full collection. We were so excited to share it today. So the collection launches next Monday, the yes. 24th on doseofcolors.com. All the details too will be in the description box if you guys have yes. any questions or if I- Prices, forgot something. everything. Yeah. And then the following Sunday on the 30th, it launches at Ulta. Woo! In store yes. and online. We're so excited for this. We filmed our makeup looks that we have on right now. Close your eyes, man. Uh, these makeup looks we filmed to get ready with us on Desi's channel So make yes. sure you guys go check that out We're gonna be using a ton of the products obviously all the swatches were in here, but we're yep. actually using it in her video So make sure to go check that out and let us know what you guys are really looking forward to mm -hmm. in the comments down below Thank you guys for all your support on yes. our first collection And we hope you're as excited as we are about this collection. Okay. So thanks for hanging out with us, and we will see you in the next video. Bye, Bye. <laughs>
You're a hoe. It's an effing cool shade. Yes. It's effing cool. It's effing cool. I just stuck my thumb in it, so Yeah, that's you cool. ruined it. That's sick. Zoe, will you stop fucking walking around, please? Just pick a spot. Halibut. Fish. <laughs> salmon. Do you want a little <laughs> cucumber salad? <laughs> they might not. <laughs> you almost fucking stabbed me. You're sitting on your feet right now. Because I want to be taller than you. Oh, do you see this? I was like, wait, why am I all of a sudden so small? Do I have anything in my teeth? Dick. Mouthful of dick. <laughs>